In this example, we want to estimate the value of each derivative and then sketch f prime of x. So f prime of 1, we're looking for an x value of 1, and we're focusing on the slope of that tangent line. And that one's pretty easy. That looks like a horizontal tangent line. Let's say its slope is 0. The next one's not quite as obvious. We want to look at f prime of 2. So here's 2 on our original f, and we're trying to estimate the slope of the tangent line. Your estimate might be a little different than mine. It's helpful if you can draw a sketch of a tangent line. It's hard to draw a sketch sometimes. So let's see if we can approximate that slope using our slope formula. So we have a y value of 0 minus a y value of roughly 1.1 divided by an x value of 3 minus x value of 2. So that gives me negative 1.1 over 1. Roughly negative 1.1 is our slope. Next, we'll do the same thing at 3. So here's a point on 3. We're looking for the slope of the tangent line at that point. So we can draw a rough tangent line to that point and guess the slope or estimate the slope. So again, we'll use a slope formula. If we're looking at this coordinate, that looks to be roughly y value of negative 1 minus a y value of roughly maybe negative 0.1 over an x value of let's say 3.5 minus 3 that will give us negative 0 0.9 over 0 0.5 so that's roughly negative 1.8 again just estimating here And then at 4, eyeballing that one, it looks like it's pretty close to the same as 2, the f prime of 2. So let's say that's roughly negative 1.1 as well. And then at 5, we have another horizontal tangent. We can say its tangent line has a slope of 0. So again, these are all estimates. Yours might be slightly different than mine, but let's use these to now sketch f prime. So when x is 1, y is 0. When x is 2, y is roughly negative 1.1. When x is 3, roughly negative 1.8. And then at 4, negative 1.1. And at 5, we get 0. And now we play connect the dots. And we have a rough, very rough sketch of f prime.